Wildcats are getting ready for their home opener this Saturday night against Colgate University. After coming off a tough loss up in Orono, Maine last Friday night, they're going to have to adjust a few things as they get ready for this weekend. Colgate University, on the other hand, is coming off of a win last Saturday night against Holy Cross, so it's safe to say the Raiders are going to be coming in with a little more confidence. Earlier, Coach Mack said that they're going to experience challenges from the offense, especially the quarterback, so the Cats' defense are going to have to find a way to shut that down. Colgate has extremely efficient offense. They are really good at what they do and how they do it. And it all starts from the quarterback position. Uh, Bremerman is a, 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 a sophomore, and um, he's a really talented kid who makes that offense go. He makes great decisions. He runs the ball, and he runs it with authority. He has a good arm. He puts it on people, and they have receivers that can go up and get it. And they're a really physical football team. Um, they like to control the line of scrimmage, so we've been focusing on you know, plugging our gaps. They like to establish the run, and then from there, they've been doing a lot of play action. So um, we've been focusing on keying our eyes, uh, don't really look at the misdirection, and just focus on our keys and just everyone doing their job. With starting quarterback Trevor Knight out with an injury, Sophomore quarterback Christian Lupoli is going to step up this week. This is why I came here. I, I look forward to times like this, games like this, where I come in and I have to do something. So I've been, I've been dreaming about this since I was a freshman here. So I'm, I'm super excited. Getting my mind right, making sure I'm in the playbook, uh, knowing everything I have to do, where my checkdowns are, everything like that. So I think I'll be ready. He's a good football player. And what I mean by that, Al, Knows and understands the game, has a good feel for the game. He locates the ball very, very well. He's got an accurate arm. You know, when he gets time to set and see what's going on, he's pretty good. Individually, I think we need to take care of our jobs. Everybody has their own job that we have to do in the offense. If we execute everything we have to do on each play, we'll be all right. I think just execution. I mean, I know defense, we did not tackle well at all. So um, yesterday we worked on tackle, and that was the main uh, focus point. And then on the outside, just winning one-on-one -on -one battles um, on both sides of the ball, offense and defense. I think um, if we do that, then we should be pretty good this week. The Wildcats are home this Saturday night for a 6 p.m. kickoff with Colgate University. UNH is celebrating Youth and Football Night this weekend, so don't forget to get your tickets. For UNH Wildcat Productions, I'm Natalie Martin.